This is a custom painted Furby that I did. Uh, it's white Furby I bought and I thought I'd custom paint it. Uh, you can see I've put um, swirls. I did these with a sharpie on its back and uh, the ears are shiny. I use nail polish. Can't really see it very well in this light but they are shiny you see there. I painted the tail. I mean, the ears, the other side are shiny. I used nail polish on them as well. They look pretty cool in the sun. It's not very sunny today, though, unfortunately. And then I used um, a fabric marker to paint around here. And this here on her beak is nail polish as well. I don't know what she's doing. There we go. Um, and then her sensor here. Well, it's not actually a sensor. It's a sensor on the old Furbies. But uh, is also nail polish. You can see it's shiny there. And uh, yeah, so I thought I'd custom paint a Furby. Oh, I remember you years ago people used to do this and they used to like take the eyes out and paint the eyes oh, different colours and yeah, yeah, yeah. sort of stuff like that. Uh, this Furby was um, a second hand oh, white and Furby that I got off eBay. Like, oh, cheap. They said it worked and they were right, it did. Okay, it was in good condition, so. Um, I found that the white ones actually go for quite a lot of money, so I probably um, customised something that's worth quite a bit. The white ones are pretty expensive to buy brand new. So yeah, I'm, I just like customising things and I thought I'd paint my own further. I don't know how many other people have done this with the new ones. But um, no, I, I just thought I'd do it. I actually did this a few months ago. It's been waiting for me to make a video of it. So yeah, custom painted Furby.